Welcome back to Living Local. Looking to catch a movie this weekend? Well, hey, you know, we have the guy, the one, the only Mike Schultz, arts editor for The Reader, here to tell us all about what's new and give us his review. Hey, man, Indeed. how are you? I'm doing well. Yourself? I'm doing great. Good. So, Good. Uh, I'm curious what you thought of Long Legs. Let's I, talk about it. I liked Long Legs. You did? Okay. I didn't love Long Legs. Okay. Uh, but a lot of people did. That made a bunch it of money. Did. New huge record for opening. Neon, 22 million or something like that. Yeah, yes, huge Long opening. Legs is a creepy as all get out serial killer flick <laughs> um, about this character named Long Legs, who sure. for 30 years has been attacking families and basically getting <clears throat> the father of the family through means unknown to slaughter the family and then end his own life. Chaos. Nobody can figure out what's going on. Uh, they should have looked at the opening credits of the movie to figure out who the, the killer is because it says Nicholas. Cage as long legs right in the opening credits. <laughs> and there's a reason for it because he plays the d d d oh gosh, delusional, diabolical madman in this. But the opening credits are almost daring you, saying, yeah. We're going to tell you it's Nicolas Cage right away. You're still not going to believe what he does in this movie. He is so wow. freaky. He has weird kabuki pancake makeup and he's got frizzy gray hair and botched plastic surgery. You can barely recognize him. Wow. He talks in a weird sing song that turns into a shriek. Everything he does is nightmarish and memorable, and the fact that you know it's Nicolas Cage is of no help at all. <laughs> you're, you're just like, nope, I'm still, I'm still scared beyond belief, even though I've seen him do crazy for 40 years. Yeah. The rest of it is a decent serial yeah. killer flick. It explains too much in the last, uh, the last act, and it doesn't end very satisfyingly. But oh. it's worth it for Nick Cage. Yeah. Man, oh man. Well, he's so good. He's in so general. good. He's so good. And, and never does the same performance twice. Never. Which is, ever. <laughs> Which I love. I mean, and he's been at this, like we said, decades. Yeah, decades yeah, yeah. and decades. And he's still killing it. So. Yeah, he's one of the best. So Worth it. It's at uh, right. Last Picture House right now. All right. Or it's a Friday. So. All right, good. Yeah. All right, man. I'm I'm all in on this next okay. one. I really am. Twisters. Yeah. I cannot wait. I'm a big Glenn Powell fan. Me too. And I love Twist. I love the original. Everybody so does. super curious. It's like, yeah, exactly. And it's held up really, really well. It really I mean, has. what? That's 28 years ago the yeah. original Twister came out. We finally, folks, have a sequel. And it is apparently a standalone sequel. Well, it's not filled with any characters from the first one. Mm -hmm. This one stars uh, Daisy Edgar Jones as a uh, employee for the National Weather Service in New York. She used to be a storm chaser until a tragedy ended her uh, interest in that field. She gets a call from a friend saying that there's unusual activity in Arkansas. You should come check out. She reluctantly does. She runs into Glenn Powell. There he there is. He Glenn is. Powell himself as a <laughs> uh, as a social media star and a YouTube hound who films all of his adventures. My guess is that she's going to be uptight and he's mm -hmm. going to be free loving and they're going to yep. hate each other and then they're going to fall in love. I bet they do. Well, and who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? With either one of them. They're adorable. <laughs> yeah, right. In the meantime, we've got all sorts of twister effects and it's going to be a lot of chasing yeah. and uh, uh, I, I'm looking forward to it too. I can't. I'm, I can't I'm, I'm here for the Powell Assance that we're in because I'm he's in that. everything. He's in everything. Put him in and more. Fine. I'm perfect with that. <laughs> I can't wait. Yeah, no, so, yeah, I love be fun. Powell. Twisters. It's going to be great. Yep. All right, man. This next one, Oddity. It looks like one. Um, yes, it does. Oddity. <laughs> so it's another scary movie, folks. Uh, this one is set in Ireland. Uh, big, creepy mansion in Ireland. Uh, there's a <clears throat> woman who's home while her husband is uh, at work, and a guy with one eye shows up at the door and says, Lady, you have to let me in and protect you because there's a man inside who wants you dead. Mm. We apparently find out through a f uh, cut uh, to the next year that the woman got killed. We don't know if it was by the person in the house that he said it was, if it was by this guy. And so the woman's husband gets, uh, involves his involves his wife's twin sister, if I have this correct. Why would why, you? Why wouldn't you? <laughs> She's apparently a psychic who, through touching objects that the deceased have touched, can kind of see the past. Sure. And so we're going to try to solve the mystery of how the woman got killed. Uh, forgot to mention, the psychic shows up with a big scary mannequin who's well, got holes in his head. Well, who because doesn't? why not? If, if, yeah, and, why uh, not? It, exactly. And we're wow. going to try to suss out the crime. It looks, uh, it looks, it looks, looks like odd. It live up to its name. It it's sounds going like. to be an oddity for sure. And yeah. I, I love that they threw a sacrificial lamb out against Twisters just in case there was somebody in America who didn't <laughs> yeah, want to see that movie. Right. So we do yeah. have an option for you folks if yeah. you're not up for the Glenn Powell <laughs> assault, the charm offensive. Yeah. Well, I guess, uh, yeah. yeah. Well, good luck with that one. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll, I'll, let you know, I'll let you know. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll see, see. at Twisters maybe. <laughs> well, hey man, let's go over what okay. we talked about real quick. Long Legs, uh, which you kind of like. And then yeah. Twisters and Oddity couldn't be crazy more double different. feature in my future. Absolutely. <laughs> well, good luck this weekend, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, you can read Mike's movie reviews online at rcreader.com. We'll have all those details posted at ourquadcities.com.